Three months ago, my friend Ryan Lewis was looking for a job. So I said, how about you come work for me? You can start by entering this contest Xfinity is holding. And so, with Ryan producing, Jory Karen's acting, Zachary Little's writing, and your help with votes, we won that contest a few weeks later. The grand prize was a trip to Hollywood to attend the MTV Movie Awards. Zach and I chronicled the entire four-day weekend on our respective travel vlogs, but the highlight of the trip was an opportunity to interview celebrities on the red carpet itself. Uh, have you watched Lost? Yes. Because could you like, I, I, I kind of missed it. Do you think yeah. in like 30 seconds or so you could just recap the plot for me? I can't. I just, okay. Because I, well, what happened was, I, you know what a PSP is? Yeah, yeah. I, I had, the, the only game I ever got on that was the pilot of Lost. And then I never watched it until I got this uh, this part. And I, I've, I'm, I'm still in the first season. So but you're, you're cramming right now. I, I, yes. Okay. And, but it, I'm, I'm still in the first season. I mean, it's it's already blowing me away. It's amazing. Let me know how it turns out. I heard there's I will. like uh, an island. Yeah. And, um, you know, there's a plane. And there's a plane and it crashes. Oh, it crashes? Yeah, oh. Oh, spoiler oh alert. Okay. Uh, have I said too much? <laughs> what are you looking forward to tonight? Um, I'm really looking forward to Harry Potter winning. You think that's gonna happen? Because, like, Twilight has a ground Twilight, operation. It does. I mean, I don't have a problem. Yay, Twilight, though, but, like, Harry Potter, come on. You know, it's just the best. <laughs> well, I, I, I'm with you, you know, in uh -huh. spirit. So the two of us together, I don't even think it happened. But you know, we will Hopefully. look at each other sadly when Harry Potter loses. I'm glad we can share that. <laughs> all right, so a couple of things for tonight, all right? Mary, have sex with, kill. Andrew Garfield, Jesse Eisenberg, Osama Bin Laden. Osama Bin Laden. For which one? Did she have sex All with All three? Him? Yes, yes, yes. Did she have sex with his dead corpse. <laughs> Honestly, I'm not going to lie to you. I don't know who any of the other people are besides <laughs> Osama Bin Laden. We like so. Osama Bin Laden. Okay. Mary have sex with Kill. Uh, Newt Gingrich, Mitt Romney, Sarah Palin. Sarah Palin. <laughs> that was easy. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, have fun tonight. All right, bye. So, I'm more interested in you. Tell me about yourself. Well, uh, you know, my name's Zach. Uh, I'm from Boston. I really have no idea what I'm doing here. I'm what about a, you? I'm Larry Poindester. I'm from Dallas, Texas originally. I'm on a show called The Hard Times of Art MTV. Uh, yes. Hard Times of R.J. Berg on MTV. The Hard Times of MTV. That That's is the Hard Times of MTV. Right. It is not I'm the Hard so Times of right MTV, now. is it? Yeah. It's not. It's no. Yeah, exactly. You've been here longer than I have. Yeah. I'm sorry. So, um, now, now uh, what, do, what do you make of the, the controversy that Army Hammer's body double on the social network did 80% of his rowing? I am deeply, deeply upset about that. Yeah. Uh, I also thought they were twins. I don't understand how come I didn't know that they were actually just one person. Yeah. But that's unfair. David Fincher really messed with me. Yeah, it's pretty terrifying. It's terrifying that yeah. you can do on television. No, all right. I got a question about werewolves. Yes. Okay. So anything can trigger a werewolf. Uh, you know, they turn into the werewolf, right? It's not. It's not the. It's not the moon anymore, or is it? Uh, well, actually, if you look back in the werewolf mythology, um, we did a lot of research as writers, and uh, there's differences, actually, from being bitten and being born into it. It's, it's thought that the ones who are born in it, born into it, can transform at will. And the ones who are bitten are the most monstrous ones who are kind of beholden to the full moon for their transformations. We've taken a little liberties in Teen Wolf on how that happens. Yeah. So we basically say whenever his pulse rises or he gets a, a adrenaline flowing, then he's uh, liable to change. All right. So and then what brings it back? Is there like a safe word? You know, like is it like you say Fran Tarkenton and then he just turns back into a human? <laughs> uh, not exactly. He's got to calm down a little. Okay. So you just yeah. have to calm down. Okay. I like yes. that. So it's yeah. like, you know, you're a, you're a teenager. A safe word would be good though. Yeah. You'd probably think that up for a second season you think hey you know you can use that one I, for free so what's different for like you know for like the youth of today when people dance at Footloose do they turn into a vampire or a werewolf does that happen no no but damn man that's a good idea where were, where were you about half a year ago <laughs> I think what you should do is just cut together a trailer where it looks like maybe that happens you know, you know? What's really I gotta say the one thing that I'm pretty happy about with uh, with our version is that you know we've got our, our Ren McCormick comes from Boston uh, and uh, comes down to Georgia and so it's set in the south I remember when I was like I was hanging out with the guys and I was telling them I was like you know what it's really cool that we got a couple like American dudes in this movie because I, I think I think we've had enough with like the, the brooding Euro dudes you know what I mean <laughs> alright good I'm, I'm all for that let's get some corn fed boys in there you know what I mean no more brooding and some dancing instead absolutely absolutely right. I think I think we're gonna do alright <laughs> I have faith in the future so good luck me too me too have thank you night. you too nice to meet you 
Stevo. So you are nominated tonight for your work in the King's Speech, is that correct? Uh, no, I'm nominated for my work with Pooh. Oh, right. That's okay. I, I was. That's what I was. Uh, that's what I thought. Right. Yeah. All right. So uh, you also have a book I see behind you, right? right? Yeah. yeah. Professional idiot. A memoir. So now, uh, how much money do you make from writing books these days? Is it pretty bad, or is it? You know, it's probably pretty bad by uh, by. by <laughs> And I guess you'll find out, right? You know? Yeah, man, I, we'll see, you know? Yeah. Kindle, I heard the Kindle is, uh, you know, a popular thing. Is that... I just bought one. Yeah. It's amazing. Do you think Ryan Reynolds' eyes are kind of too close together? I think he's gorgeous. Yeah. But, like, you know, it's like in an alien gorgeous way. Yeah. We're going to have a moment together in the show tonight. Oh, yeah? All right. Well, we'll look forward to that. Thank you for stopping. Thank you.